What's up YouTube, Groovy Mac here. In today's video, as you can tell by the title, we're gonna be doing something I haven't done in so long. Kinda honestly scared, I already rolled it up, so we're kinda ready, this is just the intro part, but honestly, haven't done this in forever. Last time I did this, I did this with Carlos, how to convince him, and by the title, you already know, man, it's gonna be kinda nasty, something I'm not looking forward to doing, but it is kinda crazy here just to see how or if it works. I've tried the Moon Rock Blunt only, that never worked, it was too runny. You can never get it right. There wasn't enough dry herb inside of the Moonrock Blunt to keep it lit, it would always go out. The stem and the seed blunt, that never worked too good. The seeds were kind of crazy, really dangerous to pop. This time around, we're just gonna do the stem only, all right? It sounds crazy. Again, I am not looking forward to this. Make sure you guys follow me on all my social medias. My Instagram got deleted, so make sure you follow me on my new Instagram, groovy.mac. Tap in with that. Still got my Snapchat. And then my ex, we're posting on there. Twitter, that's what it's called. We're still posting on there. So appreciate everyone locking in. A lot of a lot of cool things coming. We just did a live stream with Fulcrum. That was cool as hell. We did the Eric thing. So we got some other stuff coming too. So appreciate everyone leaving comments, showing love. Right now, I'm just kind of trying to yap because we can't really show anything crazy within the first one to three minutes. So yeah, it's not going to be good. <laughs> Stem blunt. We're gonna. We're definitely gonna have to go outside. It's gonna stink. Do not want to smoke this inside. We're gonna go outside and smoke it. My hot box it just to see the stuff I do. Get a little close up to it. Roll pretty well. Stuck together, but I already know it's not gonna taste that good, man. Not gonna taste that good. A lot of you guys have asked questions about the glue, so here it is. This is the glue I get from Brothers Broadleaf. They're the ones that do the cigars. These things, I love their glue, man. The glue's probably my favorite product out of them all. The cigars are really good. I just get backwoods for so cheap, and they're so consistent. It's so easy to get it. With the Brothers Broadleaf, I have to order it, because the smoke shops over here tax a little bit on the, on the leaves. But I do have to get my glue from them. I love the glue. It's all natural. It's made out of plant cellulose. Love this thing. I know I know it's cool because a lot of people use honey or all that. Honey crystallizes when you smoke it. So it's not good. This is all you can eat it. I've seen the video of the one of the owners of Brother Bodley. They have two travel glue packs. It's probably like this big. Quite a bit of glue in there, but he cracks it open and just eats it. It's crazy. And this is kinda like I don't know. Does it taste weird? It kinda does. It tastes like I don't I don't I'm not even gonna say it. It's like a flavorless like glue. I don't know. Don't knock it till you try it. The glue, I love it. Don't use a lot, of course, but that's what I, I plan on using to put a bunch of blunts together. I didn't have the glue. It was really hard to do that, and I would always use a full fronto leaf, and I would cut pieces off that, but what I've noticed is probably a lot easier to glue the blunts together instead of just doing one whole thing. Just glue some backwards together. I think I have yapped long enough. Let's get to the rolling, and we'll go straight to the smoking right after, man. All right, let's show you what we got here, man. Not looking forward to this. This is all for scientific purposes only. This is how I de-stem it. Oh, there's something right there. Let me go. This is how we de-stem it. So, kept this for a little bit. Last time I done this was probably years and years ago. I did it with Carlos. This was a stem and seed, but this is just stem. It's going to be disgusting. All right, now that we zoomed out a little bit, I think the best way to roll this thing would be a backwood or a tobacco leaf of some sort. I would not recommend smoking one of these at all. And if you do decide to smoke one, do not use paper. Do not use a paper. Picked out a good leaf. You guys already know this one. I've done this like a million times. There we go. Empty the guts back into the pack. This is a really fresh pack of backwood, so I really ain't much to worry about. All right, now immediately, I know I don't have a lot of herb or a lot of stem to roll up with. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take this whole stem all the way out through, so then this will be the rolling area. And I saved myself on smoking a lot of tobacco. There we go, just cut that off. Like that, we could probably cut this too. There we go, ready? This is gonna be bad, and I'm gonna have to be careful not to pack it too tight. Like, look at this. I kind of want the crumbs, because that's like, 
the best part of it. All right, gotta be real careful when I pack this. There's a huge stem. It's working. So I'm just holding it right now. I'm just pretty much just trying to shape it. The stems are a little bit sticky, so it'll work. I see one hole poking. Just packing it, packing it, packing it. And I'm gonna fold it right here. Oh yeah, I just broke that stem. Oh no, I just had some pieces fall out. I just really need to tuck it right back there. Boom. Hey man, if worse comes to worse, this thing is gonna get you somewhere. All right, let's examine. So it's a little coming, look coming a little bit loose right here. I guess I could put a little bit of glue. I think I did pretty well. Dry hitting it. Look at that. Mouthpiece. We are outside. We're in the car. We're gonna try to make this quick. It is a little too warm to be out here, man. Here we go. We got the the stem blunt. This is all for scientific purposes only. Scientific purposes only. I am a professional, so do not try to recreate or attempt anything you see here on this video. This is like my boys say, man, this is all CGI. The editor edited this all up. I am even AI. So let's get it, man. This is the stem blunt. Nothing else. You've seen it. it smells kind of funky. Oh, my goodness. All right. Wish me luck. Woo! This shit hitting spicy. It's like... Since there's no herb in it to like kind of help it slow down, I'm just smoking straight stick. Oh, can y'all hear that? All right, let's try again. Bro, I'm gonna smoke this in two seconds. It's not as bad as I was thinking. Before with this with the seed one, you could hear it pop, but oh yeah, you know. Let me see your blunt. Psych bro, I bet I could pass this to someone, they wouldn't even know. Maybe they would by like those. The hissing sound coming from the blunt. Y'all ever hear those like stories way back in the day? I don't know if it, when y'all were young, y'all would smoke and they'd be like, bro, like you hear the seed pop in the blunt, you'd be like, oh shit, your nuts are gonna hurt. Oh, your back is gonna hurt. Y'all ever heard that? They're like, bro, don't smoke no stems or seeds. Your back is gonna hurt. Or your nuts are gonna hurt. All right, yeah, I'm just gonna fucking knock this thing down, bro. Let's just kill it. I gotta spit. I rolled it great, though. It's burning good, surprisingly. Halfway through the blunt. This thing is disgusting. Let's get a clip from my Instagram. My new Instagram since my old one was deleted. Y'all wouldn't believe what's in this, bro. This is a stem only blunt. Look, listen. It's getting kind of dark in here, huh? Yeah, I, I, for some reason, I do not, you know, I'm just going to spit. Pause. Hold the remorse. Yeah, 
Do I recommend this? Not at all, bro. Do not try it. Does it work? Yeah, it does work, right? If you dry, you ain't got nothing, you save your stems. This could work. This could work. The only reason I'm doing this is for this scientific purpose only. Okay? Thank you. And I'm not even really doing this. CGI. I just ashed in my car. It's not even good ash. It's ass ash. Ass ash. Thankfully, I did some good stems. I put the great herb stems away for a little bit so I could get these. So honestly, it could be worse. It could be way worse. You know, I wasn't saving all my stems, but I did save all the good stems for this. You guys seen it in the close up. I'm probably, it's getting hot in here, man. So I'm gonna end this thing again. Do I recommend it? No. Does it work? It does. I, I think, I think I'm getting somewhere, but thank you for watching this. If you stay to the end, thank you. Appreciate you. Everybody that's tapped into my new Instagram, thank you as well. But you already know, man. My name is Groovy Mac. Till next time, hope you stay groovy and smoke a doobie.